zero is one. Okay. This is called the zero index. All right. Now, I am at page sixty-three. If you are still talking, you may leave the room. How quiet. If you look at example six, evaluate each of the following without using a calculator. Forget power zero. Straight away you know it's one. Okay. Next one. 2x0. This one may have a problem. Some people are being careless. Can you see that this is actually 2 times 1? Well, what's 2 times 1? Answer will be 2. Okay? Next, look at part C. Where's the bracket? Where's the bracket? Part C. 2x to the power of 0. What is this? This is a 1. Do you understand what I'm talking about here? There's a difference between part B and part C. Yeah? Can you all see that? Where is the location of the bracket is important? Everybody clear? Okay, last part, part D. This one also is important because a lot of people make mistakes. This one means it's a negative one, right?
your next move. Now, are we clear so far? I've been going quite slowly here because I want to recapture what I have learned during the Richard Hill days. Are you okay? Okay, huh? Alright, now, next. Can we all look at page 66, example 8? Now, there's one thing about all levels that I need to tell you. For all levels, right, even if the question did not say that you must leave the answer in positive index, all answers must be given in positive index. You do not leave answer in negative index. Understand? That means all powers must be positive number. Everybody clear? Okay. Alright, now let's look at example 8. Simplify each of the following, leaving your answer in positive index by the whole bridge. Okay, A minus 7 times A4 divided by A minus 3. Now, usually I don't like this. Oh, look up. I'll be alright like that.
masculine of 27 is 3 also. Okay, now, I want to tell this. When we say like that, the answer is 3. Yeah? Correct? Because it's a positive here. Can see it? Invisible. What if I say like that? The answer is what? Negative 2. Now, let me just warn you. When this is an even number, the number inside cannot be negative. It's always positive. Why not? Okay, okay. Right? Now, let's take a 
smoking, I want people to be smoking. First of all, I have this first one. Do you all agree? I've changed the negative to positive first one. Can you see that I'm using this first one? Over two. 
This is three y plus one over three squared. I'm talking to you. Three y equals to three negative two. Alright. What is y? Negative two. Now, if you want to skip this step straight away, you can see this part. It's perfect. Understand? I want another step is because I scared you cannot see. Okay, alright. Last question. Y, Z equals to 27. Now, you must always push the number to the same base. Okay? When you said 9 is actually 3 square, then I Z. That's it. Equals to 3 to the power of 1. Now, I always write Z this way uh, because I don't want to confuse with two. Some people are here writing it so terrible, right? I think what you don't know what is two and Z. You understand? Oh? So, this is 3, 2Z equals to 3, 3, right? What do I do now? 2Z equals to 3, what is Z? 3 over 2. Do you understand now? Do you understand now? Ten or ten or? I'm going quite slowly, yeah. Okay, I want to try this question for you. It's at 3 or 30, it's not the full question of the two. What's the value of it? Nobody is to do my inspection, you cannot inspect and tell me. Because if the number gets complicated, there's no way to inspect. Do you understand? Can you say 9 and 3 have been changed to what? Base 1. Base 3, right? Okay, all of you are 3. 3 power 2 minus 2, right? Alright, times what? 3k. 1 is actually 3 what? Go, oh, you must know this. You don't say one or more, I don't know what is one. Okay? This will be three what? Focus. Negative four times three k equals to three zero. So three negative four plus k equals to three zero, right? You can see that one. So negative four plus k equals to zero. What's k? K over four. This is how you do it. Look at the gate here, anyhow you. I said, uh, by inspection, what well, I can see. The third put all 27, 243, then you die. You understand what I'm talking about? Okay. Huh? Oh? Then you cannot inspect anymore. You're going to ask the police inspector to come. Because you cannot see anything. Do you understand now? Can or cannot? Write down this answer. Okay? Write down this answer. Alright. But what I said, I will stop here. Okay. And I'm going to give you some questions, but I'm going to go through all these questions first. Okay. Can I take this away? Can I take this away? Okay, go. Of 
A power N. And the second one, A N root N. Do you understand? It's the same thing all together. Clear or not clear? Okay, you must know how to apply. Alright? Okay, let me just double check. This is your WA right? Tomorrow, WA1 cannot. How first of all? Okay. Here, you think this one, I don't know what you're doing. I'm going to give this book on the board. Huh? It doesn't mean that for WA or to do homework, or to do this, 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 or to do you no need to complete by tomorrow. To complete by Thursday. Ah, the knee's going to be I'm not so good one You wait for my total instructions first. You see, uh, I usually do not very high one. You must understand, huh? Ah, not very high one. Okay. Yeah. All right. Now, mm -hmm. this set of work is being done in the notebook. By Thursday, 23rd of February. Are you clear? That means if you don't want to do this work today, don't want to do this work tomorrow, don't want to do anything, you must do it on Wednesday after your day rest of the week. Do you understand what I'm talking about? Yes or no? Because I'm going to go to do this on Thursday. Clear? Okay, don't. Five questions. 